Appalachian Wireless proudly brings you unlimited data. Unlimited data is only $80 a month for a single line. Four lines as low as $200. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless, an East Kentucky network company. Data speeds slow to 25 gigabytes per line to 512 kilobits for phones and tablets and 15 gigabytes for modems. See store for more details. Packaged alcohol sales began in Jenkins in the first quarter of 2017. For the last two quarters of 2017, as it is now, two stores in the city sold packaged alcohol. Jenkins Mayor Todd DePriest said the alcohol sales have added more than $6,000 to the city's coffers. Well, it was um, extra revenue that we might have had in past years, and, and it's able to be used to help uh, supplement salaries for the police department. And that loosens up money in the general fund that can be used for other things. The priest said the city received approximately $3,100 in revenue from alcohol sales in the third quarter of 2017. In the fourth quarter, the city saw a slight increase to approximately $3,300 in revenue generated from packaged alcohol sales. The mayor said he's glad those revenues are being collected now in the city of Jenkins, rather than other places such as neighboring Wise County, Virginia. Those revenues were being sent across the hill for 71 years. Uh, that, that was you know, available to us, but, you know, it always went somewhere else. Jenkins Mayor Todd DePriest told me he had no idea and really no expectation for how much revenue the alcohol sales would generate. So any revenue that's generated from those alcohol sales is a big help to the city. To the yeah, we really didn't have any idea, you know, what total sales would be and, and, and where it would fall. Um, it started off a little slow, a little bit disappointed at first at the, at the half quarters we had with the, the different stores. Uh, but, you know, that, that, that money goes a long way toward uh, supplementing the police salaries, and it, it, it actually helps in a, in a big way. The priest said the revenue generated from alcohol sales must be used on either the city's police department or on administration of the alcohol sales themselves. He added that the city has not experienced any uptick in crime since alcohol sales began last year. In Jenkins, Chris Anderson, EKB News.